I am telling you again and again, the current Stalin government is the most dangerous government ever seen in the history of annals of India. Mark my word, wait for five years, wait for eight years, you will know what I am talking about. The Tamil Nadu and Kerala are going to have the boots of PA of the China, if it is required. Otherwise, there is going to be a local amount of rebellion and uh, local amount of uh, crisis. And uh, another Jammu and Kashmir will be seen in both the Tamil Nadu and Kerala. You wait for that. And uh, mark my word, most dangerous CM today in the country is Stalin. Either on his own accord he is doing this thing or he is handled from abroad. If his handlers are abroad, equally dangerous. If he is doing it on his own, it is equally dangerous. Unfortunately, the Delhi is far away. It is practically, it is, uh, I would say, sleeping. Not knowing what type of things are developing. Many of the activists are unbelievably uh, pro-China. Not only that, the entire post is uh, now with uh, a particular type of church control. They say that you cannot uh, conduct any activity because these are the purified land of the Christ. And Kudam uh, Gulam, all of you know, it was instigated by church and China. Kindly note, the sterilite uh, agitation was fully, now I am convinced, is by China. Because the beneficiary of the copper uh, uh, export is China. China has got a factory in Pakistan and they are the net exporter. India, in spite of having a huge facility, is closing it and then we are importing copper. Can you beat this? And they say that uh, that uh, copper facility is creating uh, cancer. If so, then 50% of that fellows at least should have cancer. Of that fellows who are working there should also be affected, right? Absolutely there is no common sense or anything anymore. 